What's going on guys, welcome back to a brand new video. Today, for once in my life, I have an empty unit just for the Fiesta. And today, the reason why I've took the BMs out is we're going to be installing some bad boy max speed and rods coilovers to Fiesta because we've got the wheels, but we just ain't got the lows and we need the handling. And these are just a great product for a great price. So this box is very, very sexy. I'm going to open this up now. I'm going to check out the goods inside. Just before I do, I'll leave them linked down below. Use code B7TMY to save yourself 7% off. And uh, yeah, let's get into this. Let's unbox these beauties. Let's jack this car up. Get these horrible walnuts off that I hate. And then we'll get some lows on the Fiesta. Happy days. Can't wait. Haven't done an install for ages or a Fiesta video. I just want to get, get some bad willows on this side. So. We're going to start up and then Ryan's going to be joining us later because he has the spring compressor clamp things to help us out. But yeah, the BMs are out. And the funny thing is, I actually have Max Speed and Rod's coil on that. And I've had them for about a year and a half on there. Gone through hell with them. Not had a single problem, no rattles, no nothing. So, I know they're a good product. Oh, he's got a rabbit and a tortoise. Oh, what a This is awesome. Burnout. It falls fast. I'm taking a shot. That thing was well annoying though. What do you think? Potential new whip? I think so. Alright, let's jack this up. Hate these walnuts, but just gotta push through and get them off. And then we get to do the fun stuff. Oh, you can't see me. Oh, the one annoying thing about this unit. The lighting is so annoying, you have to stand in the right direction. Because if I stand like this, no, I'm like a ghost half the time, but it's alright at the moment. But let's get it on. Oh, yes, boys, these are the goodies. Got a nice little coilovers installation instructions. Love that. Some customer service card. And then all the goodies and many, many packaging. But yeah, these are very nice. Um, obviously these are going on the rear. And I'm guessing that these are the rear springs. And these are the front springs. Got cool, a nice adjusted tools, but um, yeah, these are going to be the fronts. Obviously, they don't come with top mounts, so we're going to use reuse our original ones. That's why we need the uh, spring compressors. But these will be nice, Got nice adaptions on them. As soon as you get these stock ones out, it's going to be nice and messy and dirty. And I'm pretty sure you just get rid of these because it's actually pointless. Basically, Ryan's come and messed up all my great progress. I've dropped all this. This is a okay to go. Now all I need to do is take these off. We're taking the scuttle and all that off, and uh, many cable ties to get the headlights out. So just, I think these are like fifteens or thirteens or some shit. And then <laughs> Hold on. we can come drop. Right come ready. Right also, look at my craftsmanship on that. That's good. What? Oh, I wonder where my flathead went. <laughs> what is in the engine bay? <laughs> Sweet! What's the real speed, bitch? It's not your brother. Look at this. It's gonna drop. When you get to the back one, hold. I know what one. I'm doing. All right. You do realize I'm a qualified B17 technician. Ugh. Mate, buys and tries. <laughs> I did it eight on dumbbells every day. Look at that. Yeah, throw them in the bin. Apart from the top mounts, we make sure they're okay. And put the bad boys on. Well, fucking hell. Mate, it's 
I've done, I've done this properly because otherwise it's going to blow up in my face. Yes, right. Or That's why you're doing it. <laughs> Are you sure that this is alright? <laughs> Go on. Oh, you need, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> you need to, we got a pair of mole grips. got mole grips. Where are they? Yeah. In the drawer. The drawer of, the drawer of, the drawer of random pieces. That was out earlier. Steve. 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 I think you've put this box on top of them, you know that? No, you've yeah, put Yeah, you're a tip. You've put the box no, on top of them. Box. Get, get it in between the crack. Ooh. This side. This is the best way to do it. Obviously, it needs to be tight, so. You can push it. Do you, me, do you want me to hold your hand? Yeah. Oh, fucking, I'm holding that, and you're no, putting one your hand, hand in there. Calm, well, I'm you sorry, are, don't I? You masturbate a lot. Can I hold this? You hold the shaft right. Yeah. It didn't blow up on us. Boom. Oh. It's easy. I don't know why you make such a big fuss out of this. It's so easy. It's easy, easy when I'm here. Yeah, because you've got if the tools. If I left you alone to do this, you'd... I could have cable tied it. You'd have just done, done it without the spring compressor. Cable ties. Yeah, you would have done. I would caught it when it shot out. <laughs> one hand. One hand gun in, one hand cut. <laughs> no prisoners. Alright, go slowly. Oh, this is going to be low. Like, we're going to get some scene points. Yep. Out Keep of going. Here, this bitch. Yep. Yep. Ah, but it looks good, doesn't it? I think we've done a good job. I mean, luckily we've got like beasts. That's fucking heavy. Hey, do you know something funny? What? This is your fault, not mine. This, I bet is, it's not. this is the passenger side. <laughs> At least we're ready for the passenger side. I was getting you ready, Ryan. <laughs> Why'd you sell the wrong side for? No, it was you. You got it out of the box. Well, at least it's ready. But now, oh, yeah, now you got Jack. Yeah, you got Jack the other side, up, and that's just yeah, hanging. Yeah, well there you go. It's your fault, it's not mine. <laughs> I knew that friend side. I was waiting to tell you for you to tell me, so I could tell you you're wrong. <laughs> ready? No, I'm ready. Fucking get me up. All right, we've literally dropped this entire side, and I learnt that on drop links, don't do the city little Allen keys because they just round off. Margaret's behind it. Ryan taught me that. Shout out to Ryan. Now well, we can take these out, yeah, and you need to get the right size. 13 mil, mate. Why well, ain't got a 13 on there? I've got a 15. Mm. Where's that one away socket? Where's the so 13? Oh, you left it on your one. Look at that. Honestly, impact guns, best, best of your life. Because it saves you like hours and hours of time. So we've got to grab the shaft. You're, right, you're see, so, Ryan, I've got the shaft. You're so awkward. It's out. <laughs> Easy peasy. My lemons are squeezy. Again, oh, I'm getting wet standing in. Getting moist. Right. We might as well put the coil over on now. This side on. And we'll do that one after for yeah. this side. Yeah. Happy? Happy chappy. Okay, so we originally assembled the passenger side when we dropped the driver's side, so now we dropped the other side and it took like three minutes, not even that. They just gunned it all. Now we're gonna put this side in. So this side's going on and then we're gonna to get to getting the top mount off this, to putting the other coil over, and then the rear should be quite easy to remove as long as you don't round them off. Which we've done before. So we're not gonna do that. We're just gonna get these in the hole. Let's do it. Let's go. There we go. Have I done it? Yeah, let me go put that on it. Hold on. Push it up. She's See how it looks. Well, that looks bad, doesn't it? That was gangsta. Oh, fresh. mate, look how low. It looks good with the brake lines we did. <laughs> look. Obviously, Bin Man messed it up a bit, but apart from that, he's going to look creme de la creme. Mate, yeah, look at, check it up before and after fun. Look how low, look how low that's going to be. And the words are dirt nasty. Like, it may need to raise it a bit. Nah. We'll see how it sits. If not, we'll just raise it a little bit. Because don't want to be like, 
my bumper into the ground and I've got new wheels on the way for Christmas so. Oh! 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 Saying ghost stories, it's going to be low. I'm actually a bit scared of how low it might look. But, but it should look alright. And with with these, unlike springs, only have to wait for them to set. They should just set it straight away. No, you probably have to drive it a little bit. A little bit. I'm missing a the clip there. And there. And there. And there. <laughs> Yeah, well, your whole your whole bumpers. You haven't even got your fog light in there. I don't have fog lights. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna run intakes, not intakes, like cooling ducts to the brakes. Oh right, okay. But this looks good, doesn't it? Mm. And also, we just gained a new mod for the ST project. Shout out to Dan Farmer. Mm. You ready? I'm re I was born ready, man. Right, go on, I'll hold it. Be fingering it. Yeah, go on. Then. Because it comes off, comes, comes off, off the, the comes off the oh. top now. I was See about it. to tell you that. Right now, they need a pair of mole grips for the ting. Got one of these. Need to undo it. Here's one I prepared earlier. <laughs> Big old Gusenheimers. Only tight. You don't do too much. Yep. Come on, strong man. Come on. Come on, put your muscles into it. I hate mole grips, they hurt me. Right, I'm doing I've got a little arm I'm, I'm trying. <laughs> that'll do, that'll do, fucking hell. Wait, oh no, that's too much. I've done it too oh. much. I've got it. No, that's too loose. No, it's not, Ryan. It's right. got, watch this be fine and you'd be wrong. Right, yeah, what's right. that? It probably will come on. 19 long. <laughs> deep. <laughs> you lost my reducer. You're lucky, I found it. <laughs> Ready? Told you. Boom. Boom shakalaka. One. Pristine. Pristine top mount. Oh, it's all greasy. Look at that. That is like a massive bogey. You don't eat it. There to lick it. <laughs> You're a fire. You don't lick it. No. I hate that bit. Don't forget, because if you go too far back, you're just going to push it against it. Oh, baby. Yep. Fresh suspension, boys. He's going to look bad, boy. Probably gone too low. We counted this from there to there. It's seven centimetres. Last one's on. The fronts are on. They are complete. That is amazing. We're going to drop this, well, there's two axons on obviously, and then see how dirt nicely low this goes. That is not the fitment, we just took them out temporarily, but I'm excited. We can go as dirt nicely low as the 36. Skid life. Not that one. That one's not got the same coilovers, that one's not as good. Why is it like because it's on shit coilovers, it's not on these ones, that's why. It's see? Not it's not on the prestige ones, but yeah. I'll take out out and I'm kind of scared to see how low this goes. It's going to be interesting because this is the gap when it's fully jacked up. But I don't know, I feel like I'm going to like thinking it's mad and it's not going to be mad. And then you have to do live adjusting anyway. But there's one way to find out. That's nice, though. it's got a nice breeze off it. Are you ready? I'm ready. Go on, keep going. Yeah. Hey, that's pretty bang on. Are you happy? That's bang on. That's dirt nasty. Let's have a look at the other side. I don't think that, even if we actually measured that properly, that is how we probably would have gone for. I'm good or not? We are good. Do you think a little bit lower? No. No. I think it might, will it press in? Yeah, yeah, it, it'll go lower once you because drive it. This is falling out anyway. Yeah, yeah, don't worry about that. Out. But come on, when you get these coilovers, seven centimeters on the dot, or I think we actually got like sixty-nine mil, which would be precise. No, it was seven mil on the dot. It was a seven mil on the dot. 
seven centimetres on dot seventy mil. Bang on. I'm guessing we need to go lower in the rear because the rear will sit higher and it doesn't hold as much weight at the end of that, so. Yeah, we'll work it squish out. that booty down, make like squat. But I'm happy with that. That is perfect. We are too good. We're too good. Just too cool for school. Ooh. Ooh, get me these. I love them brake lines though, they're sick. We're gonna take these fifteens, drop it, axles on that. Then springs fall out. Oh, there's something. So check. I'll check. No. no, no, we know what we're on about. <laughs> and then um, to get these from the top, I'm pretty sure you go up in the arch. It's like two ten or thirteen mils. Ten no, mils up. Ten top. mils. Two of them. Yeah. Lovely jubblies. As you can see, there's a very nice handbrake cable that I fitted myself going through the rear of the vehicle. Should I gun that out? What? That. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'll hold the camera. That, will you do that? Right, right now, live action cam. Twist. Get it, baby. No, do the side first. Push it all the way down. Drop it, lock it, poke it, dog it. We have the mammoth of extension bars with a 10 mil. It's pretty much just two 10 mils up there and I'll drop it. We've got the wheel off, we've undone the two 15s and then that'll drop out and then we'll place it in the newer shock and sort out the coil over. It'll be lovely jubbly. How are we looking? Oh, hold that so it fall on your head. No. Oh. Out with the old, in with the new. <laughs> you loved that, didn't you? Mm. Class the musical B7 version. Coming soon. Okay, so we've got the rear shocks in, we're just putting the springs and adjusters in now and setting up a height. I'd say just pretty much go as low as you really can in the back. Back's usually like very forgiving. And there's no weight in the back, it's got no back seats either, so it needs to go lower than a normal person would do it because race car life. Well, to be fair, the back of my car currently is a walk in wardrobe, but apart from that, it looks sick. Oh, look, matching. Grab your merch right now. Down below. What are you doing? I'm just playing. Are you ready? Go on, drop it like Show it's it hot. Huh? Show them it first. Oh. Stop doing what though. Torch. Beautiful springs torch. in with the torch. adjusters. Torch. What do you mean about torch? You can All see right. in there. Alright. Alright. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. I hope you've adjusted this right because I said to go lower than what Ryan's done. So if it doesn't sit right, you're in trouble. Alright, yeah, I'll let you off. Oh. Oh. Fitment Kings. That's, on, that's my new Instagram handle. Fitment Kings. Hashtag get out of me. I think that's a thing. I don't know. But that looks bang on. Race car. <laughs> Okay, oh, I look dirty. I need to have a shower. All right, we're now doing testing, just to make sure before I drive home that we're all good. I don't know why he's driving, to be honest. He sort of just got in the driver's seat and drove off. It's because I can drive. But um, so far, I've not heard anything. Obviously, we're doing like five by an hour because I'm a unit. So we're gonna get on some back roads, just put a foot down a little bit, just to check everything's all good. So far, all good. But you know when you're like listening out for minor things that are probably already there in your car and then you start getting paranoid? That's what I'm like at the moment. Yeah. So, and now we're low, so I've got to worry about scraping. But we look cool now. We look cool. All right, so I'm going to wrap up the video here, boys. Took out for a dry and fiesta. It's sitting pretty, as you saw. Lovely jubblies. Can't wait to get some more action on this fiesta itself. Um, if you want to grab a set of these yourself, link down below. Max Spin Rods, like I said, code B72MI, save yourself some monies. 
Please smash a like on this video if you enjoyed. Comment down below what you want to see more of. Hit that subscribe button. Check out the merch. Check out B7 Performance. Been smashing orders at the moment, moment, so please do go over to my new website and see if there's anything you fancy. And yeah, thank you Ryan for the assist the answer. We'll see you in the next one.